Welcome to Bernard Baseball. Um, we're up early on a Sunday morning here, heading to the flea market to look for some baseball cards. We've never been to a flea market before, but we heard they have some baseball cards there, so we're gonna go check it out. Patrick's dad, Justin, told us that they have baseball cards here. So we're gonna go check it out. There's nowhere else to really buy baseball cards with this coronavirus quarantine going on. So our baseball card store has been closed. I think we're gonna find some good cards. Right, we're off the highway now. We're getting close to this place. Freaking line of cars to get into Take this the place. Take next right man. onto Steam Engine Hill. Then you'll arrive at your destination. It's crazy. I didn't expect to see this many people here. I mean, we're we're in a, still in a coronavirus lockdown, a stay-at-home order in my county. I think this county might have just gone to the yellow phase where they're allowed to do some more stuff. Wear your mask, stay six feet apart, no alcohol, you can't get drunk and look at junk. This is crazy. Yeah. Justin Bradley got his doing, man. Parking in a grass lot with a bunch of other junk. Crazy lunatics. Yeah. So it's up there somewhere. Up in here. Three dollars, I think of grapes. Oh, a box for a thing of tomatoes, that's a big deal, man. Pittsburgh Pirates Phillies. Oh, I don't get it. Hey, you want to see Oh. Five. See if it happens or not. Yeah, yeah. Alright, throw those Thank in. Uh, grab the Phillies box. Thank you. DVDs for a buck. Any sports movies or anything? Lowest prices on the planet. That's right, you can go to Uzbekistan and pay more. You can go to Borneo and pay more. What kind of off brand shit is this? Like Penrosa? It's hand sanitizer. Alcohol free. Four dollars each, three for ten on the Russell Boxer Briefs. Russell, eighteen dollars in the mall. Four dollars here, three for ten on the Russell Boxer Briefs. Russell, Russell, Russell Athletic. It is. Roger Maris movie. Mickey Mantle. Roger Maris? Kind of baseball. Six, 64 Midsummer classes. How much for the Galvanite? What's this? Got another patch, a 1990 World Series patch. Got any baseball cards? No. What do you want for this stuff? Four bucks? Nah. World Series patch. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'll get this one. I like this one. Hi. What do you want for this? Oh, I was asking three, but I can do two. Would you do one? Hey, this is my Charlie TPN. So it's got a rattle, you can hear. Jump. Yeah. Yeah. Like this. Oh, these sports are magazines. You don't want that one either. No, there's not one. Just yeah. old pictures. Maybe. Seventy bucks. Yeah. You got any baseball cards? Uh, not with me. My grandson is here. The next week, we'll have a whole bunch of them. Does it say when it was printed or how old is it? Uh, some of the players are pretty old. It's from like the 30s, I think. They were printed in the 30s? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Exhibits? It's an exhibit card. It's printed in the 30s. Look them up on eBay. Like, hold on, hold on. How much for these video games? We don't need video games. Let's go to the ATM. 
Was it, they were so in what were these things called, Josh? Uh, like exhibits. <laughs> yeah. I don't know the year. Cards? Yeah, cards. There's six for 20 bucks. There's two whole families. These are more dead. Yeah. You six of them for 20 bucks, you want $70. Forget it. Unless there's a really rare one in there or something like a Babe Ruth, but I didn't see that in you. Yeah. Oh, he's very fun. He's really tired of shirt. That's small. That's too small for me. Mm. Chris Davis, is that a rookie? Look this crap football team. Yeah. God, this is just trash. American Girls trading card. Here, you want to get this for uh, Raiden? Yeah. For his birthday. Yeah. You trade all 300. Oh, yeah, yeah, right, yeah, right, definitely. Right. Yeah, that's for his birthday. Well, this too. <laughs> oh, yeah. 20 bucks, no way, dude. What's this? Oh, it's on a binder. Baseball card album. Oh, card There we go. What are you talking What's this? I found a vintage card. I found a vintage card. A little Weaver manager. What's in this? This one. 91. 91 John. Yeah. Below it. What's the binder below it? Okay. This is 84. 84 tops. I got ask him how much he wants for these five minutes. I found an Earl Weaver car for 78. Oh, this stuff. There's an 84. Oh, there's some older stuff. Oh, I like it. Yeah. It rained on. A water damage. I feel like I caught it for some reason. Hold on, find the keys. I need to take my mask off. I need fresh air. Okay, we're back home from the flea market now, and we're gonna take a look at what we got here. So we got this stack of cards here. There's six cards there for only five dollars total. Got Hallie, Howie Coplets, a uh, senator's card. I like the Senators because they look like the Washington Nationals and the Harrisburg Senators are playing Harrisburg. Now we got Dick Grote, eight-time All-Star, won, won an MVP in a World Series in 1960. Yeah! Yeah! Got Claude Osteen. He was he made three All-Star teams and won a World Series. He was a good got pitcher. Got Ted Williams, last person to bat 400. Yeah! Yeah! Got Claudia Stremski in action. And got Ron Santo in action. We got a pretty good deal for five bucks. Yeah. Also picked up a Sean Casey starting lineup figure for only a buck. He was a free time All Star. Got a uh, 1995 American League Champions Cleveland Indians pennant. Uh, they went to the World Series that year, but ran into Tom Glavin and the Atlanta Braves and lost. Strikeout number eight for Glavin. Drop another one down. McGriff. Glavin covers. A one hitter through eight. And inning away from the end of a five year quest for the Atlanta Braves. Mark gets the sign. The wind and the pitch. Here it is. Swung. Fly ball, deep left center, Grissom on the run! Yes! Yeah, yes! Yeah, yes! Yeah, the Atlanta Braves yeah. have given you a championship! Listen to this crowd! A mob scene on the field! Rollers get them one, two, three! A couple of fans rushing on the field! And the Constables restrain them. The Atlanta Braves have brought the first championship to Atlanta. 
We also picked up this entire binder of cards here for only $10. These are all from uh, 1984. Robin Yao won two MVPs, 82 and 89. Nolan Ryan and Jose Cruz, Astros batting pitching leaders. Let me see that. It's a nice card. Reggie Jackson. This page has some good cards here. Ozzie Smith. Tim Raines, Ricky Henderson, stolen base leaders. It's a Mike Schmidt home run leaders card. Wade Boggs. 83 strikeout leaders with Steve Carlton and Jack Morris. There's Bobby Cox. I didn't know he managed the Blue Jays. He managed the uh, Braves team that beat the Indians in the World Series. Ooh, Cal Ripken. Look at that. Jim Rice, too. Reggie Jenkins. I have his rookie card. We we'll use his rookie. 66 tops. Joe Torre. Oh, I didn't know he managed the Braves, too, before I know him from the Yankees. Tony La Russa, Cardinals manager. I didn't know he managed the White Sox. A lot of these guys in here managed the older teams in the 80s I wasn't aware of. Ryan Sandberg, second year card. Ooh, that's nice. These cards are like in mint condition, too. You know, I, I think somebody must have pulled these straight out of the pack and put them right into the binder because these things are just fantastic. We also got Rock Crew. Oh, look, we got more of these leaders cards. I like these. Who do we got on this? Pete Rose. Nice. Another Tony. Pete Rose. With Tony Perez. Move that over here. Bruce Suter. Reggie Jenkins, Steve Carlton, Tom Seaver, Tony Perez, Mike Schmidt. These George. leaders cards are nice. George Brett, Rock Roo, Nolan Ryan, Steve Carlton, Tom Seaver. Ted Simmons just got into the Hall of Fame. Did he really? Yeah. I never heard of Ted Simmons for some reason. What, what was he? A catcher? Guys, stop it. We have some cats wrestling a bit. Steve Carlton. Oh, there we go. Love these old blue Phillies jerseys. These are awesome. Last page. Anybody good? Wade, Wade Boggs. Boggs. All right, there we go. Oh, Burt Bylevin, too. He's in the Hall of Fame. So overall for $10, man, I think we got a good deal on this binder. Barry, what do you think? Where's the Barry Bonds card? We also got a couple other things. We got this baseball movie, 61, about Roger Maris hitting 61 homers in a year. Um, got a couple other DVDs, too. Got Halloween, too. Old School. And Bad Boys, too. These are all great movies. And these were only a buck a piece. Couldn't pass them up. I found something really cool for myself. It's not baseball, but it's a Penn State football helmet. Got this for only three bucks. Couldn't say no to that. And in addition to the Penn State helmet, I also found these programs here. Got these for only a buck a piece. I can't believe I found this stuff. Um, this is the 1982 National Championship game program. Penn State beat number one Georgia in the Sugar Bowl. Greg Garrity had the big catch that won the game. It's first down, Penn State, Georgia 48. Lions have got a drive going here, a time-consuming effort, too. But now Blackledge is going to put it up on first down. He's going for the bundle. Garrity! Touchdown! And we got the program from the 86 Fiesta Bowl. This was a huge upset. Penn State beat Miami for the national title. Miami was number one. Jimmy Johnson was their coach. Michael Irvin was their star receiver. Vinny Testaverde had won the Heisman that year as their quarterback. And Penn State's defense just shut them down, had five interceptions, and won the game. You can't get it any closer than this. Everything, and I mean everything, is on the line. And you know he has to throw it. Fourth and goal from the 13. Testaverde oh, no. throws. It is intercepted. It is intercepted. Pete Giftopoulos, his but, second of the game. And Penn State will win the national championship. Pete Giftopoulos <laughs> with the interception. Testaverde intercepted five times tonight. Penn State, the national champions. This one, this is my favorite of all of them. This is the 1994 Penn State team, the perfect season. Kerry Collins, Kajana Carter, Kyle Brady, Bobby Ingram. 
This team went undefeated, beat Oregon in the Rose Bowl to finish the season 12 0. Brady Scott is the man in motion. Here's Carter. And breaks it. He's gone. Goodbye. It'll be touchdown, Penn State. First play of the ball game. And the game is over. The Penn State Nittany Lions defeat the Oregon Ducks 38 to 20. An untied, undefeated Penn State Nittany Lions. So overall, I think this was a pretty good take from the flea market. Didn't spend too much money. Got a bunch of cool stuff, man. So I'm glad we did this. What's up? Noah's here. Noah was sleeping. He missed the flea market trip. Does this shop have Corona? It might. There was a lot of a lot of people there without a mask, man. That could have been a coronavirus hotbed. I wasn't really expecting I'm that, here? but. So Noah took off. Josh, it's on you to close this video out, I guess. Please like our video. Please subscribe to our channel. Turn on the notification bell. Bernard Baseball, peace out. Nailed it. Yeah! 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 Almost forgot this box of Phillies cards here. We got this for four bucks. Let's see who's in here, man. Larry Boa. Oh, Larry Boa. Gary Maddox. Bob Boone. Larry Boa, All Star card. 79 tops. Mitch, Mitch the Williams, Wild Thing Williams. Juan Samuel. Is that Crook? Yeah, yes. it's Crook. And another John Crook. Like Dykstra Sport Flix 2000. Another Dykstra. Another Lane Dykstra. Steve Jeltz. There he is. We know him. Mm hmm. Well, another Lane Dykstra. Oh, we got a lot of Dykstras, man. What was this? 96 tops. Steve Bedrock Bedrosian. And a Scott Rowan. Lonnie Smith, a few of these. Never heard of Lonnie Smith, but I like these old cards because they got he's the old blue Smith's, jerseys. Um, he's Ozzy Smith's brother, I'm pretty sure. Is he really? Mm-hmm. You sure? Yeah. These are pretty nice cards, dude. Dave Cash. That's a cool name. Yeah, Dave Cash. We got some stickers. These are cool stickers. Yeah, Fleer stickers. Another Lonnie Smith. Heat Cliff Slocum. He was a reliever. Ooh, Kevin Stocker. Jimmy, Jimmy Eisenreich. There we go. Kurt Schilling. Pete Incavilio. Dykstra again. There we go, man. Another, Another one. Dykstra. Oh, cleaning up Another on the Dykstra. Dykstras. More Dykstras. We just hit the mother load of Dykstras, there's two, dude. There's two in here. Oh, my God. Keep going. This is like the Dykstra section of the box. Oh, my gosh. This is a mother load. Oh, my God. Oh, they're done. Oh, no. Scott rolling there. Now they're back to Dykstras. Dallas Green, get out of here. Go back to the Dykstras. Another Lane Dykstra MVP, MVP card. baby. Mitch Williams. Yes, another wild thing. Dykstra again. Dykstra. Crook. Crook. Oh, we got a rookie. Mickey Morandini rookie card. All right. Oh, we got a Diamond King. Oh, that's a beautiful looking card. That's yeah, cool. Yeah, that's nice. Oh, Lane Dykstra with a blue helmet. Fernando Valenzuela. Valenzuela. He pitched for the Phillies? I did not know that, dude. I thought he was just a Dodger. I don't remember him with the Phillies. Yeah, pitch with the Phillies. 94 Phillies. What are these? Sport Flex, I guess. 95. I didn't know Sport Flex was still around in 95. Wow. Dalton. Yeah, actually, I don't see any poses. I don't even know if it's Sport Flex. It says Sport Flex on it, doesn't it? Yeah. Right there, yeah. Jack Crook. Crook. Turn it. See if it. See if it. Yeah. That's, yeah. yeah. That's Crook. Sport Flex. Dalton. Dalton. Schilling. 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 Oh, we found the mother load of sport flicks, man. 95s. Hollands. Dykstra. Yes, More a bunch Dykstra. of them. We can all have one. There's a bunch of Dalton. Daltons, Dykstras, and Crocs. Dykstras. Yes, this was a this box was a huge yeah. score for four bucks, man. I'm glad we grabbed this. Look how much cards we got. Boom. Yeah! Yeah!